Within hours of swapping the Knesset speaker, Israel's incoming coalition advancing four key bills through preliminary votes and taking one more giant leap towards assuming office. The legislation seen as a precondition for agreeing to form a government. But several of the bills seen as highly controversial, with some coalition members even voting against. Not least because some of them change Israeli basic law for what critics say amount to personal politics or ideology. And not one passing with more than a slim 52% majority. The first, expanding the authority of the power over police in order to establish the National Security Ministry for Otsma Yehudit head Itamar Benvil. The second, empowering an MK from the Religious Zionism Party, most likely incoming Finance Minister Betsa Smotrich, to helm an independent office in the Defense Ministry in control of building in Judea and Samaria. And the third allows those serving suspended sentences, like Shas leader Ariya Deri, to serve not only as a minister, but to control three ministries. And the fourth, a bill that would more heavily sanction an MK for leaving their faction. Temporary Speaker Yeriv Levine saying he wants to finalize all four laws by next week. Meantime, critics also calling out the coming coalition for its reported acquiescence to religious demands. This after an unsourced and so far unverified report on Israeli news alleging extreme demands within coalition agreements from the United Torah Judaism Party. Demands including the expansion of religious gender-segregated beachfronts, gender-segregated public events and spaces including buses and even libraries, a ban on mixed-gender prayer at the Kotel or the Western Wall, even in the egalitarian space, and a ban on energy production on the Sabbath. But Prime Minister Dezeknip Benjamin Netanyahu dismissing such concerns and pledging to maintain the status quo. <laughs> יש ויהיה חשמל בשבת, יש ויהיו חופי רחצה לכולם. אנחנו נשמור על הסטטוס פה, איש באמונתו יחיה, לא תהיה פה מדינת הלכה, תהיה פה מדינה שבה נדאג לכל אזרחי ישראל בלי יוצא מן הכלל. נבחרנו להוביל בדרך שלנו, דרך של הימין הלאומי, ודרך של הימין הליברלי, וכך נעשה. תודה רבה לכם.